now that we fixed our resolution we did a little bit of customization and uh i checked out some of the skins and stuff we can now officially start the story in the correct resolution and go from there right now i'm gonna the first mission i'm gonna try it with mouse and keyboard see how it feels maybe move to my flight stick and then go from there um so yeah characters created everything else seems like it's good to go we'll probably get that cutscene again but this time we can actually watch it and yeah we'll be uh gucci from there hopefully it doesn't make me recreate them are you kidding me bro <laughs> are you kidding you're joking all right we got to recreate a character for like the fifth time bruh it's okay i got it down pat at this point all right so this one was casa davik except then this one was get there another day another Whoa. shot at the end so wrong so one oh, there it is this one was ace Ace Clay. Boom. Except. Asadavik and Ace Clay. Except. Except. Story mode. Except. Space. Ladies and gentlemen, cue Darth Vader. After the, a long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. Q Darth Vader. Alderaan shows destruction. <laughs> they incited rebellion and anarchy. Much better. And paid the price. The survivors continue to spread dissent. Find them. Do not them. rest until the destruction of Alderaan is complete. I will not, Lord Vader. I will do your bidding. Yo, what's going on, Sailboat King? How's the game so far? Uh, after some resolution issues and things like that, I've created my character for about the third time now, so we're literally just getting started. We've had some issues getting it started, but... Here we go. Are they? Yes. Wipe out all that remains of Alderaan. How? I understood the survivors were in hiding. Intelligence reports a possible Alderanian convoy heading to Fostar Haven. You are to draw them out and finish them off. Do you understand that, Captain? <laughs> Perfectly, Commodore Sloan. Dismissed. Perfectly. Maybe I should turn the, uh the game back up the audio <laughs> he looks like my dad when he was younger Captain Davis. everything ready Lieutenant Carol squadrons on their way they're excited Carol Danvers command. and you no qualms hunting down refugees from a world we destroyed? During the Iskalon uprising, you taught me to ignore propaganda. They're traitors, not refugees, and will be dealt with accordingly. <laughs> I've prepped our usual Sigma-9 loadout. No. Only standard ties today. Flying old school, sir. This might be a real challenge after all. I mean, the game looks pretty good. Teresa, but I don't think you understand me. I guess we'll find out. Ah, there's me. And don't fire unless I give the order. The convoy is out there. We don't want to scare them off. Let's do this right. If 
Cat, Twill that's me. Twill be done. <laughs> you did say something right there. You do get to cho choose like a bunch of like different uh, voice lines and stuff, which is pretty cool. So I still can't decide. Do I play the first mission with mouse and keyboard or do I try it with my joystick? I don't know which to do first. I don't know if like, is this like the perfect game for a joystick or is it like joystick or you're doing it wrong? Joystick is the only way. <laughs> What's going on? Boot up your cockpit systems. All right. Understood. Let's see if I can pick it up then. <laughs> I kind of do want to try it in VR, like not going to lie. I have my here ready. My Oculus is right here. So I could try it. Not not right this second, but maybe later on. Play the first mission in VR. I would look so sick. I would literally be like the entire time. You're just gonna see me sitting here like Looking around all over the place. <laughs> Man, I love space. Con I haven't played any like good space games in VR. I will try it. I don't want to try it the first mission, but I will try it for sure. So I'm wondering, I guess, do I have to select like to change it to joystick or light stick or something? E Valkyrie is okay. Wasn't a fan of it, how they did throttle control. I keep forgetting No Man's Sky has VR. That would be pretty cool to try out. Must try it on stream second mission. Maybe. Trying to see something. Yeah, it's all or nothing. Uh, where do we change the controls to flight stick? Or do I have to take off first and then you take... They do have like a lot of settings and stuff. Here we go. Wait, flight stick one device? Why is there two? <laughs> Give the people what they want. I will, I will, I promise. Dull sticking. <laughs> do I set it to two? All right, I guess leave it at that. Oh, wait, it just showed up a second. Oh, snap, here we go. Okay, okay. Okay, so press one. Oh my God, this thing's like a little dirty. This is what I'm currently using. It's the Logitech 3D Pro, which it also said in that. That's for your co-pilot. Oh, okay, that's pretty cool. All right, this looks pretty sleek. Uh, so let's try. Where's one? One is that. Okay, I got it. It's the trigger. Beep, beep, beep. All systems up and running. I feel like this is a great game to play in VR too, because you're sitting. So like when you put the headset on, like I could actually leave my webcam on because I'm just gonna be sitting here, looking like up and down and left and right and stuff. It's not like you're standing up and walking around. So I do agree for that. Tap one, two to target. Okay. Forward sensor, online and tracking. This is why you play a second now, mission in VR. And deploy out of the hangar. It's been a while since I played a game in VR. Wait one sec. I want to turn on, turn up the, uh, this. All right, slide her up. <laughs> oh God, oh God. Wait, what? It's inverted? All right, that's confusing. When you pull back, it goes down. And when you pull, push forward, it goes up. Like, invert flight. 
There we go. Oh, the rest of the fleet is back Whoa, from holy death. crap. We'll have plenty of help We're already flipping up upside down. Let's see if I can uh, stabilize this. It's hard to like actually flip their correct way. When I push left and right, it's only like. Copy that. Oh, okay. That's weird. I feel like all the settings are like the opposite. Like when you push right, instead of like the the rudders like going left and right, it's like the opposite. So like when you t tilt it sideways. Instead of like the thing started flipping the other way, your it's like your rudders are going that way. And then when you turn like this, like when you turn like that, then that's what flips you. That's like the complete opposite of like uh what's it called? Um the other game. Microsoft Flight. Cause of invert. <laughs> trying to see if I can find that let's try changing both of them to that light Uh, oh wait, light, light stick. Yeah, so pitch up is up, pitch down is down. I feel like there's a way, there's got to be a way in the controls where you can just like straight up change it. See all this in situation like this, wonder <laughs> who would crash first. Me guaranteed. Squad team play colors red and black. Absolutely, dude. That's so weird. I mean, like, I'm kind of getting used to it. But oh, it's so confusing. All right, I got it. I got to figure out how to do that. Um, controls. I wonder if it's really as easy as that. Like you literally just put on your VR headset and then you're good to go. Guess we'll find out one way or another. <laughs> Someone's running a poll. Um, where is it? Controls, customize controls. Wait, normally they, like, I mean, I had the option under gameplay to change it. Auto target next. Auto experience standard. Filter profanities. Watch your profanity. Controls. Invert look, invert flight. Throttle input continuous. <laughs> we all know the outcome of this poll. How long is it going for? Joystick plus VR. <laughs> uh, power management selector. Arms wheel input, disable state input. Alright, <laughs> there's gotta be. I don't see anything like invert or change. So I'm gonna just try changing it myself then. Remap controls, light. Light stick. 
So, y'all right, x-axis. So that would be this. And that, oh wait, then roll right. Wait, no, 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 the opposite. Y'all right, y'all left. Then roll right and roll left. Side or up, side or down, combo. Where's nine at? Save and exit. Oh, seven. <laughs> Hold on, chat. We're going to try it. Ah, I need to listen to my people. I'll set it up. Only because it's like probably hopefully easy set up. I need to clean this thing out. This. Look forward and press. Is that the minus sign to calibrate your headset? That's this, right? Oh, that's this guy. Got it. All right, everything looks good for you guys. So now, like, can I use my... Okay, cool. If I use this controller, I guess you can't do anything with that. But I can still... How am I supposed to change the settings? Looking forward to the same cutscene for the third time. True. Whoa. Alright, this is actually kind of cool, like... Seeing it like this. You guys see everything good? It looks like it. I can't see my mouse though, that's the weird thing. I guess you're supposed to just use this. Okay, S story. Uh, K to restart mission or continue story, continue mission. Let's try continue mission. All right, just let me know if anything happens, chat. I can see it, so hopefully, oh God, everything's like glitching out right now. What the? All right, I think we're good. Are we good? Do you guys see? Yeah, you can see. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, let's do this. <laughs> it's a little laggy. Also, the game is like pretty loud for me right now. But hey. The game is quiet. Oh, really? The game's quiet right now? Oh, wait. Is it even, is the audio even going through? I don't think the audio is selected on the correct thing. That's why. No, no it is. Oh, wait, that's me. Wait, I don't even see the... Hold on, let me try restarting this again. Rookie mistake. I didn't hear... Don't hear the game at all. Because the Oculus Rift thing should show up right here. All 
Okay. Hello? All right, so. There we go. All right, you guys can hear that. I can hear that. That's going through, right? Yeah, you hear it? Okay, let's test, test this. There we go. Oh God, B42. Oh God, I'm going back in. <laughs> Yo, what's going on B42? Appreciate the raid, guys. Stay mobile. We don't want any collisions. This is so loud. Is it loud for you guys? This is pretty loud for me, so I'm gonna turn it down a bit. It should it should be about the same volume, anyways. All right, good audio balance here. Okay. I kind of feel like I should be like sitting up higher, but. Are you a big Star Wars fan? Yeah, I would say so. Um, I feel like I'm a, a good amount of a Star Wars fan and stuff. I uh, I actually have this game through EA uh, EA Play Pro, so that's why I'm trying it out. Yeah, I don't even want to see what happens when I when you crash. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Like someone is testing battle formations. Better here than in the field again. Keep your distance, Helix. Those engines run hot enough to vaporize a tie. I've known a few daredevils who for science. <laughs> True. Tie pilots push the limits. Sometimes the limits push back. Oh God! It, it does lag a little bit here All and there. All calibrated, and the fleet is in good shape. <clears throat> the vigilance reports out goes anti transport. Do so you get motion sick? Um, the first time I ever did VR, I got really, really, really motion sick. But, um, after that, I've been, ever since then, I've been fine. Follow down below the Gazanti so its locks can engage. I do easily, that's why I sold my VR. Yeah. Oh God. Here we go, chat. Helix Squadron are docked and clear for hyperspace jump. We're Remember clear. Helix, we'll have support, but finding the refugee convoy is up to us. They won't escape the Empire twice. Oh, that's pretty cool how it plays the cutscene. It plays it like right in front of you. And he crashed. <laughs> it's like watching a movie. Dude, I can watch like Star Wars like this. Whoa. 
<laughs> Lost our haven. Probably the most isolated trading post in the sector. It's only a haven for thieves and pirates. If the refugees Watching are somebody here, play VR compared to actually claim. playing VR always looks so different though. Like there's the hands. Looks like a very tight fit. Could see it. See theater is renting out for corn. VRs for quarantine. <laughs> that would be pretty cool. So I'm trying to move my mic. Can you guys still like hear me good and stuff? That would be sick watching all of them in VR. I feel like being like enclosed in this area kind of actually helps with the VR thing cuz like there's a lot of cargo traffic today. If you couldn't see um agreed. All cargo vessels. This is Captain Lyndon J. If you couldn't see that and it was just open space, it'd be like floating in space. And that would be a mess. If they cooperate, they'll be fine. Pilot, proceed. Yes. Check your forward sensor. It will identify potential targets. Targets at this. Oh, okay, the sensor. Pilot, begin by inspecting that ship. Uh, scan an unknown ship, the object face it up and press 2 to target, then approach it, your scan will begin automatically. Okay, cool. Wait, wait, we have always been loyal to the Empire. That's what they all say. See, Cargo verify. I swear. Um, I know that jazz. Sensor to find the cargo ship. Okay, so we basically just need to scan a bunch of them. Next. Look, I'll pay anything, just don't impound my ship. Cargo oh, verified. Check another ship. So you're not impounding my ship? There. A ship's trying to flee from a simple inspection. We should teach them some manners. Where are they All at? Pilots, bring your weapon systems online. Oh, is it? Wait, is it this guy? Track it on your sensors and fire a small volley. Just enough to damage them. Then see if they're hiding. Wait, is it this guy? Is. I can't tell which one it is. Or is it the red one? Oh, that guy. Hey, stop that ship. Chase. Trying to get it in that. There you go. Don't run, bro. No refugees here, sir. Just smuggled weapons and a cargo of spice. Handle those smugglers. We should get to the station. Cycle through targets. Uh, five. I think that's five. My customers are legitimate traders. You have no right. How does the joystick feel? It definitely de it actually feels better. Just activated. I can't really see myself playing this without one. To be honest. Uh, power up to divert. Wait. Laser pointers. Okay. I feel like the cams or the uh, things right in front of me. So. You have up to 
divert power to lasers. Lasers will recharge faster. Trying to like get used to this. There it is. Honestly, I just feel like like I'm like at an arcade. You know how like when you sit in those little machines and you have a screen in front of you and like everything, like one of those Star Wars arcade games. That's honestly what it feels like right now. Terminator of the Alien Blaster games, yeah. So how do you? Captain James, I think I found. Ah, uh, I see. On our way. Pilot with me. Did you go, Lieutenant? There she is. Here you get back here. I can't get him. Ah, he's right there. Come on. I can't even see him. There he is. There he is. Got him. Got him. Run shields. Some starfighters like X Wings have re regenerating shields. You must blast through their shields before you can do damage to their hull. Shield. Okay, I see. All right, enemy reptile turns white to red. I uh, shot will hit the target. Watch the enemy roger, roger. and lead your target to land a perfect shot. Got him. I forget, is that? Captain, the rebel fighters are coming from that tunnel through the station. The refugee convoy must be hiding in there. After them. We'll deal with Okay, I think I get that now. Yo, Andy, thank you for the follow there. I'm like trying to look at my watch and I'm like, oh wait. Why can't I look at my watch? It's a pretty cool seat. Pilot, get into the tunnel and hunt down that convoy. There, the convoy. Prepare to fire. Ah! <laughs> Sorry, Teresa. After all the run, <gasps> I can't ignore what the Empire's become. Sir, Linden, what are you saying? That I don't care who ordered it. I didn't sign up to hurt innocent refugees. And if protecting them makes me a rebel, that's Yo, so what's going it. on, Pat? This game's multiplayer Dad, triggers me more than pilot. sports. <laughs> See if you can bypass his shutdown. How come? Have you? Did you try it yet? Mash any button. Catch 
Power to engines. I hope you wouldn't come to this. Missiles, watch out! Let us leave. Don't make me return fire. Uh, repair your hull. Use three. I'm not sure which one's three. This guy. Beep, beep, beep. All right. Enemy players are literally a pro pilot. Imperial Squadron, this is Refugee Convoy Home of Eldera. We have families aboard. I'm here to help Convoy Leader. No time to explain. Just get out of this tunnel. I wish you'd seen things my way. Goodbye, Teresa. No! There are some pretty great areas to fight, though. That's pretty cool. I am so, like, into actually watching a, a movie like this. Like, seeing it like this is pretty cool. Like, right in front of you. Like, just right there. Not really any distractions. Echo Squadron. Pat, you'll have to come over and give it a shot. <gasps> That's hey, me. Almost forgot you were there. Whoa. This is a much different layout. That call sounds desperate. Can anyone make out what he's saying? They're working on it. Okay, Echo Squadron, on me. This is Admiral Akbar to Echo Squadron. <laughs> Echo Leader. Admiral here. Akbar. Admiral, any luck pinpointing that distress call? Hopefully. You may need to get creative. Make sure your fighters are in good shape. Understood, sir. Echo, prepare for systems check. Coming back around, Squadron, on me. So much for a quiet patrol. Starting systems check. Mm-hmm. Copy. Mm-hmm. Copy. What's the uh the plan? Follow Echo Squad Leader, run full systems check. Uh how do I run full systems check? Alright, this one looks pretty cool. Prefer line ships, to be honest. Yeah, I can definitely see it. Uh, I'm trying to see how exactly. Okay, power management. I see, I see. They definitely look different. Power to engines. Okay, cool. So blue is engines. Empire needs to see through cockpits that. I keep looking like up to the right to try to read chat, but I forget that it moves up and down with me, technically. Uh, uh, up to divert to lasers, Weapons got it. They'll look better when we're shooting okay. The helmet projectile video fields from the outside of the air aircraft as an overlay. Right, too. 
divert to shields. Double check shields. Right. We might need to hold out a while. Yeah. Because technically, like, I can see through to the right or to the left or up and down. Meanwhile, like, when you're in the other one, all you can see is, like, what's in front of you. Systems check complete. In formation. Echo 3, matching formation. Echo 2, standing by. Echo 5, standing by. Don't bump into me. Okay, squadron. Anyone low on missiles needs to stock up now. <laughs> Yo, what's going on, Huck? Huckle. Yeah, if only you guys could see. TIE Fighter barely feels like VR. Just basically everything's in front of you. Okay. Yeah, true. Good. That's what I was saying. Honestly, like, I really feel like this is similar to, like, if you go to, like, an arcade. And you go into like one of those like little like Star Wars machines where you like you take take over a uh, TIE fighter or whatever. It kind of just feels like that. Do it, boys. Admiral, we're here. Yeah, but the convoy's way over there. Put the bad guys between us and them. Echo Squadron, transfer all power to engines. Head below the Star Destroyer and wait for my signal. It's 10 risky. 4. Ever powered engines. The Star Destroyer's hull should get us to the other side safely. Steady. Hold. Yeah. Now, fire all boost thrusters. Nine. Oh god, I don't know what boost is. Uh, nine. Nine. There it is. All right, ready, chat. I think it's this one. Yeah, this one. Boom. Oh god. Oh god. Oh. Oh. Rip. <laughs> Remember your training. Admiral, we're here. Yeah, but the convoy's <laughs> way over there. Put the bad guys between us and them. Echo Squadron, transfer all power to engines. Head below the Star Destroyer and wait for my signal. I have that death to the scoreboard. <laughs> flying fast and close to the Star Destroyer's hull should get us to the other side safely. Steady. Hold. Hold. Chat, hold. Now, fire. Fire. Boost thrusters. I'm at 5%. I'm gonna die. Formation. Capital ships are moving in. Rebel Alliance forces. The convoy needs support. Wait, that was an Imperial transmission on an open channel. Echo Squadron. Move in and give them cover. But do you press and hold it? Or do you call. just I press it? Those ties any longer. Who are you? A defector? If you'll take me, call me Linden. I'll explain later. Pilot, help me push these fighters back. Echo 4, leave that No scene from the prequels where uh, Omi crashing in a carry and jumps then out. Imagine doing ties. that in VR. <laughs> Actually, though. Blast 
so sketchy. I couldn't let the Empire destroy more innocents from Alderaan in the name of security. So you told the Empire where to stick it? You could say that. No, you don't. Got him. Oh, God. Keep pushing. They're done. I'm very injured. Enemy on my tail. They won't bother you again. Hey, you did your job. Ah. Uh. Can't see them. There they. Wait, where are they? There they are. Oh, that's Captain James. Yeah, got it. I'm trying to figure out, like, Echo Squadron, how do you heal? How do you repair? I'm right beside you. I forget. I totally this forgot my training. Three. Oh. Uh, is that this guy? Aha. Uh -huh. There it is. Just keep pressing it. Squadron, there's a quasar bearing down on the convoy and filled with reinforcements. Take the ties down. Beep, beep, boop. Wait, I'm pressing three. Oh, that's five. Rip. <laughs> oh my god. Today's the uh, the first Friday of the month. So that means that uh, the new Humble Games just dropped. I know how this Imperial fleet operates. I can tell they're prepping their capital ships for an attack right now. We need backup. <laughs> All right, I'll send you the rest of Echo Squadron with everything. There he is. Got. Heading towards a Star Destroyer again, facing its turrets this time. It's okay, our fleet's coming. Well, not fast enough. Fleet is now at your location. Echo Squadron, keep the convoy safe while the flagship Whoa. engages the vigilance. Leave it to us. Wait. The Empire's sending in a raider to intercept the convoy. We have to take that raider down. Pilot, with me. Almost in range. Get ready. Ah! <laughs> Wait, really? No way. He was number one. <laughs> okay. Good. Their shields are weakening. Keep the radar focused on us, not 
Uh, it feels pretty immersive. I honestly can't see what's going on. They're trying to get cover from the capital ships. Because there is. Finish this. Oh, I might have been first for you for recommended. If you're in the under the recommended, uh. Oh yeah, it's probably recommended for you though. Raider is gone. Good work. Echo, let's get that convoy to a safer location. Head to the far side of the MC-80. Uh. Oh, there it is. Oh, oh God. Refugee convoy, we're out of time. We've got to get you out of here. Refugee convoy to Rebel Alliance. We're ready for light speed, Joe. Wait. The Star Destroyer will be watching all possible vectors. They can still find you. Pilot, it's risky. But if we can destroy the targeting system on the Vigilance, we might throw them off the convoy's trail. Wait. You two are attacking the Star Destroyer? Let's hope your feet can keep those shields down. Take down the vigilance is targeting. All right, we're gonna ready three, two, one, swing it around. Going in, boys. Pow, pow, pow. Pow, pow, pow. Got him. Keep firing and exit. That's it. Vigilance is targeting is down. All convoy vessels prep for light speed jump. I reach coordinates. Let's get out of here, boys. <laughs> that would be really cool. You saved a lot of innocent lives and mine. No, you. No, you, Captain Javis. Red three going in. Preparing for light speed. Yeah, co op would be pretty sick. Do we know how long the, uh, four years later? Damn, what? <laughs> uh, do we know how long the light or dark freedom campaign is? The Empire chose to destroy Alderaan in order to spread fear and douse the fires of rebellion. But the heroic pilots of the Rebel Alliance have chosen to keep fighting, to show the Empire that we are not afraid. I heard it isn't super long. It ended Palpatine's reign and brought about our new Republic. However, the Empire lives on, shattered though it may be. As I speak, Imperial forces are edging Wait, toward the Bormia sector. Oh, it says I roughly eight, eight, new Republic eight hour campaign. As their empire collapses, that's actually pretty crazy. Their grip. But the galaxy is changing, and you can be a part of it. With the help of Me? brave and daring pilots, this war can end. Make a choice. Fly with the new Republic. Change our galaxy for the better. Mainly made for multiplayer, true. Star Wars Squadrons. Yeah, I feel like that's a de decent length for, uh... Damn, that was just the prologue. You have completed a prologue. Adventure just begins. You can now continue a story, recommended, or go to the main... Uh... Let's go to the main menu. That's two. I want to do some customization. Most VR games, I feel like, sub eight hours for a single player experience. Yeah, definitely. So like, how does this work if I wanna, aha. If I do customize. Very like laggy a little bit, especially in VR. Okay, that's pretty sick. So customized pilot. There I am. Uh, 
Uh, so six is to get to the next screen. Wait, that. Okay, I see. I see. I want to put that helmet on that we got. That I did originally put on, but it didn't work. So. Um. So this guy. And that. That. Put this suit on. The gloves. That. Someone's got to do it. Why me? Oh, uh, my nose itches. Uh. Feel like there's like little like dog, dog hairs. Two goes back. Should allow you to make clans, AK squadrons. That would be pretty cool. Um, six. Oh, I like You're that. gonna like that. I do like that. Whoa. They have a bunch of logos that you can use. Huh. You can automatically throw on like a red. Uh, oh, that's pretty cool. <laughs> they have Ewoks. I like that. Drink your water? I will. I will in a second. I need to actually go open the door, too. I do like the customization and stuff. That'll That's pretty cool. Coming right up. Uh, ten is to switch to the hang imperial hanger. Uh, ten. Call my squadron. Evan died. Customize pilot. Edit loadout six. Okay, so that one's already equipped. Cool. Excellent uh, choice. Okay, we go back. What works best for you? Okay, that's all set up too. Very good then. Okay, cool. Perfect. It's pretty cool. What are they doing down there, huh? All right, we can exit the hangar. All right, we'll uh, run the next story mission in a second here. But before we do that, um, I'm going to take a quick break, just like run to the bathroom and all that stuff. Uh, all that good stuff. And then uh, afterwards, we'll we'll jump back in so I will be right back my hair is completely messed up now look at that <laughs> so I'll be right back and then we'll continue <laughs> 